novels and comic book fan and uh, uh, I haven't done uh, I haven't done a, a video in uh, a couple weeks um, a lot's happened in the past couple weeks uh, I realize I'm a little overdue for a video uh, I've just been making a lot of appearances on a lot of shows uh, doing a lot of things I gotta do in my own life taking care of things at home uh, you know what I'm saying at the same time as working on my comic book uh, but in any case uh, I'm here this evening I uh, thought I would throw a quick video together today uh, because, again, like I said, I'm overdue. And, uh, yeah, lots of things to talk about here uh, while we're here. So um, I figured uh, I'd throw some things together. Uh, my computer's acting uh, really wonky uh, with uh, with uh, the things that I've been throwing together in these videos. Uh, I think I maybe have to do a reset or something. But in any case, uh, if you didn't know already, uh, my campaign is now live on uh, Indiegogo. Uh, so if uh, you haven't had a chance to go over there and have a look at a uh, soul tack, uh, please do. It's over on Indiegogo. Uh, we've currently raised a 2,800 uh, uh, Canadian or a $2,050 US uh, dollars from 37 backers. And I just want to say thank you so much to uh, the 37 people out there who've supported me, uh, supported me in, uh, following my dreams and, uh, helping me to make things possible. So, 
Um, going through my campaign a little bit, if you haven't had a chance to go through it already, uh, the video that you saw in the beginning was uh, um, the short trailer. Uh, in here, there's there's a there's a minute long trailer. I swapped the two trailers out. Uh, if you haven't had a chance to see the new trailer, uh, I can throw that uh, up right now. So. <laughs> And I just want to uh, I just want to take time to uh, thank Justin uh, for for making those two trailers for me that the uh, 25 second trailer you saw in the intro of this video as well as the uh, the one minute trailer there. So with my campaign again, like I said, I'm new to all this. I'm a brand spanking new creator, uh, having never worked in the comic book industry before. I spent uh, two years studying how to make a comic book, and then two years putting my comic book together myself. So because I have no previous resume experience uh, in the comic book industry, you, you need a start point. So it's just logical that in order to do this, I would uh, create the book first uh, to show you what I'm capable of, right? So uh, in this campaign, if you didn't have a chance to toggle through some of these features, uh, so again, there's that video. Uh, there's also a video in there. Again, if you haven't uh, subscribed to my YouTube channel, uh, well, you should be in my YouTube channel if you're watching this video, but uh, please do so uh, as well. In the description, I'll be adding uh, a couple other YouTube channels uh, that I recommend uh, visiting if you want to see uh, more uh, indie comics creators out there, as well as uh, some uh, campaigns that are currently live right now uh, as a thank you uh, to, again, other creators in the industry who've, who've uh, generously given time and uh, allowed me to come on their show to uh, promote my comic book. I just want to say thank you so much. I appreciate it. I'm very much one of those people that believes that time is money. Uh, they're, they're both interchangeable and they're just as valuable. And uh, thank you so much. Thank you so much for, for uh, again, allowing me uh, a place to talk about my comic book. Um, so go, again, uh, going back through my campaign, here's some promotional art. Again, if you'd like to go back and have a look, that's some stuff in the book. Again, it's all labeled and listed. And this is, this is a, these are panels and excerpts that you will get from uh, within the book. Uh, as well, various discussions. Uh, people have asked uh, various questions. Uh, I've now uh, locked up the questions and the discussions for backers only, uh, just for obvious reasons. Uh, for, if you support my book, please feel free to ask any questions and offer any suggestions you can. So uh, in my updates, I've now put a, a third update because we now uh, we finally uh, raised a 2,050 U.S. dollars. Thank you so much. Uh, again, we're 17 days in and finally crossed that that uh, threshold today. And thank you so very much for that. Thank you for your support. Uh, again, there's a bit of a project update in there. Uh, I can talk to that uh, in other ways, but I just figured I just want to give you a quick look at some of these updates uh, so you can see what those are. So again, I'm live uh, 17 days into the campaign, and uh, it's very exciting uh, for, me to, for me to be doing this for my first time. So, uh, here's, some, uh, here's some other updates as well I decided I would uh, share with you. So here, here on this page, if you're looking at this, this is all the lettered pages. So this is how much progress we've made on the lettering. And... Uh, because I've uh, I've showed this before, I feel comfortable in showing this uh, here as well uh, for you here. So here's the uh, the first six pages of the book to give you a good idea of exactly what it is that you backed. So you can tell uh, just from this here, 
uh, the level of the detailed line art. Again, uh, Gonzalo Loyola is the artist. Uh, he's uh, Myself and Gonzalo have been working on this book for two years now uh, at about a page a week. Uh, so you get an idea, 88 pages of uh, continuous story, which is a lot for a first-time graphic novel. Uh, to put that in perspective, that's the same as three, fl uh, four floppies, uh, four single-issue floppies, which uh, is standard in the industry for what uh, usually they order up front, is, is four floppies up front, and that's what's basically contained in this graphic novel, which is why it's at the price it is. So if you figure uh, today a floppy is roughly $5 in the store, uh, again, it's a little bit more pricey, again, because I'm not uh, a big mainstream publisher who, who can print hundreds of thousands of copies, right? So in any case, back to um, uh, the six issues. Uh, you can read here. You have an idea for the artwork, the colors, and the lettering. So you can see this is all um, uh, my creative team. I, I, I'm working with uh, the best artists I could find that were willing to work with me on this production, and we've been at it for two years. So here's page two. And you can get a feel for the colors. Uh, again, for, for what it is that uh, uh, my sequentials look like with my pages. Uh, I know I've, I've probably shown you all before that um, I do the sequential, I do the layouts. So when people ask what it is that I do for my book, uh, there was page one there. And uh, we're, on, uh, we're on page two here. Uh, that's that's what became page three. Uh, that's what became page four. Page five, and then page six. Right. So there's your there's your six page preview. I'll give you an idea and then it, it moves right along into uh, uh, the main story so I thought it would be uh, cool to take this opportunity to share those first six pages with you uh, just so you can see and again those are those are completed lettered pages out of the book that's how far along we are uh, progress wise So here is the line art book, which uh, I talked about it, it was going to be uh, Blood and Ink. That's uh, what we've called the book, Blood and Ink. So here's what the uh, main cover will look like now. I, uh, we finally had a chance to go through. And uh, you can see it's a little more gruesome. Uh, it's been uh, accentuated with a bit of blood. Again, with the theme of, of, of the overall intent of that book, right? So if, uh, if you're a blood and art, uh, blood and ink backer, uh, or you backed both books, uh, this is roughly a, a good look at what the uh, line art version of this book will look like. And then uh, again, thank you for stopping by. Thank you for coming to my channel. Uh, thank you to everyone that subscribes to my channel. Thank you to everyone who's backed my book. Again, I'm a brand new creator. I'm, I'm just brand new to this. Um, I, I don't know uh, what they expect from somebody who's literally 17 days into this, uh, but uh, I'm just doing the best I can. Uh, again, thank you to everyone who's supported me so much. Thank you to everyone who's backed me so much. Again, I've been at this for three weeks. Uh, not three weeks making the book, but three weeks campaigning uh, the very first time for my very first book. And uh, every creator has to start somewhere. Uh, that's just a given, right? So, so thank you. Um, so yeah, so here's some more examples of uh, again what you'd be getting into with the uh, the line art, a uh, blood and ink version, and you can see everywhere there's blood, there's blood, right? Uh, I hope you're having a good evening. Um, yeah, it, it's a it's a gruesome book. Uh, I did everything I can to warn, and. Uh, on the covers of both the books, it, it will it will say for mature readers only, and uh, I will do my due diligence to make sure that for every copy I can possibly sell, that uh, people understand that yeah, again it's uh, uh, it's definitely for mature readers, right? 
So here's a here's a look at where we are uh, with the uh, the color version. So this is this is the book that's going this is the part that's going to take the most time, right? Uh, understanding. Uh, usually, again, it's taken us two years to get this far. It's taken me two years to get to a point where I felt comfortable in launching this project, as well as tying up. Uh, I was uh, previously employed with my previous career, and uh, I wasn't able to really stream. However, I knew I very much wanted to create this comic book, so uh, out of respect for my employer, uh, I did make my, my comic book while I was employed. However, I wasn't active in streaming. And I do know I have to pick up the streaming. Uh, with more support, uh, as this channel grows, uh, as people continue to show support, I most definitely will uh, go to streaming. And I would love to um, I would love to get StreamYard. And I would love to get other creators on my channel. And uh, perhaps that's something I will do in the future. Again, it's just a matter of... Um, Finding an equilibrium, uh, finding friends, uh, finding people who I trust and who trust me, and then uh, and then growing from there. But but absolutely, I understand the philosophy that uh, all creators are supposed to um, uh, work together, uh, get in this together, and, and I completely understand that philosophy. But at the same time, you have to start somewhere, right? And I'm just brand new to this, so uh, maybe I'm working a little bit backwards because I, I did my graphic novel first, but I felt that I needed some sort of a foundation uh, uh, basically to prove what I'm at. Imagine trying to crowdfund like this and having nothing. No artwork, uh, nothing to show, uh, no example to show others of what you're capable of. Uh, in my opinion, that would be even worse because uh, now you can't even see uh, what the overall uh, vision is for the project. But while we're here, uh, I figure why not we'll have a look at a, a couple pages from the color version. Nice. By the way, yeah, that says uh, here, uh, if you can, go su subscribe to uh, Lord Crackhead Jeremy. Uh, he's been doing this uh, House of the Dragon stream. I, I, I think there's uh, only a couple of those shows left. I love how these updates are coming out. It's awesome. Uh, 80s Made as well. It's another YouTube channel. I highly recommend. These are channels that have supported me. And, again, I'll put those uh, channels in my uh, description. Uh, again, just to say thank you so much. Uh, shout out to uh, Lord Crackhead. Uh, shout out to 80s Made, Belmont Press, uh, Dave Brink, a Death Metal Hero. Uh, again, so many, so many channels have gone out of their way, and uh, I'm truly grateful for all the support I've been given uh, so far. So, don't mind me. I was on a stream like two days ago. Uh, I got really drunk. I, I, so I told myself I wouldn't do these streams uh, getting drunk. Believe it or not, I actually hadn't had a drink for 17 days since I launched. And then somebody invited me on their show. Uh, uh, and needless to say, uh, yeah, I, I went a little over the edge. Um, luckily, they uh, deleted the footage. A little embarrassing, but uh, yeah. T uh, two things you should never do when YouTubing: never expose uh, and never expose your your uh, stuff that should be covered. I know that seems like a given, but that's been an issue in the past with some other people. As well as you should really avoid getting uh, uh, really drunk on streams. But in any case. <laughs> um, uh, I'll show a couple pages in here that uh, recently just came back from Colors uh, this week. Uh, we're, we, so we've now started Colors. Sorry, get myself back on track. So if you see the bottom of this page, you can see all the flats. That's where Shane has done her magic to flat the pages. And now at basically two pages a week, uh, we figure we can color all these pages. So roughly eight pages a month. Even though that sounds like great progress when there's only 30 pages left in the book, that's still three or four months worth of work. So... This here is what's holding up uh, me printing the books the longest, is getting these final pages to colors, okay? And it takes time. Everything takes time. Again, two years. This is two years of production. So, so here's, uh, here's page 62. Uh, Gonzalo just turned this in with the uh, colors. Again, amazing work. Like it's just absolutely beautiful, and that's that's again that's what every single page is going to look like in this book. All eighty-eight pages of interiors. Uh, once this is lettered, and uh, this is the other page uh, that he turned in as well. Again, beautiful stuff. It's going to be an absolutely fantastic book. A beautiful book. Uh, you've backed this book. You're going to love it. If uh, you're watching this for the first time, 
Uh, again, doing everything I can. Please, please back this book. Uh, please support it. Uh, this this campaign, I'm doing it a little bit um, differently than most in some way in that this book is already completed. This book is already funded. I don't necessarily need um, I don't necessarily need financial support uh, with with this book per se, but um, funding this book will determine whether or not I continue with this. Funding this book will determine, uh, like supporting this book will determine whether or not I do get StreamYard and I do start contributing with other creators. Uh, find other people to partner up with. Again, try to grow this this try to grow this brand. Try to grow SoulTac. Uh, try to grow my channel. Um, again, but it uh, absolutely it's reciprocal. And at some point you need to start, right? So again, uh, for for the amount of money I'm out of pocket uh, for paying for my book, uh, to how much I've been supported so far, obviously I've spent more uh, than I've gotten back, which is not a problem. Like I say, everyone who backs my book will get my book. But if you look at my campaign, I'm trying to hit a, a stretch goal of uh, $25,000. And yes, that's a big number. It's a big target number, but that's the target number that I need to continue. Okay? That's the target number I need to start getting StreamYard and start doing taking this seriously. Uh, $25,000 is the target number that I need to start production on the next book and start showing you making me making Soul Tag 2. So it all ties in together. Um, yes, you absolutely need to build a YouTube channel. I get that. Yes, you need to stream. I get that too. Uh, yes, you need a foundation and some sort of resume for this is what my art and my project and my book will look like so people can see uh, to take you seriously. Uh, yes, you have to fulfill to prove you're capable of making this book and fulfilling it uh, to anybody who has faith in you and backs you and supports you. So uh, there's a lot of um, there's a lot of, of uh, really interesting chatter going on out in uh, Twitter. Uh, I've noticed it since I launched my book. And again, I'm not uh, I'm not trying to pick fights, but it's just funny, you know. All these other campaigns come out, and you don't hear uh, this much uh, beefing and. Uh, uh, it's just very strange, and I've only noticed it since I launched my campaign. But uh, whatever, what can you do, right? All I can do is just keep thanking the people that support me, thank the people who follow me on Twitter, thank the people who follow me on Facebook, thank the people who follow me here on YouTube. Thank you, everyone, for your support. Haters are going to hate. And you know what we say about haters? Don't give money to your haters. So uh, those of you out there that want to want to hate me, it's fine. I, I just won't back your books. Uh Again, you can't control the audience. Uh, you don't have any control over Indiegogo. Uh, you don't have any control over the customers. I don't know uh, where this attitude is coming from, but ultimately the customers will decide. The fans will decide. Never take your backers for, for granted. Never take your, friend, your fans for granted. Never take the people who've backed your books for granted. You understand what I'm saying? So again... Anyone who's helped me so far, thank you. Anyone who's backed my project so far, thank you. I can't say that enough. Uh, I can't do this without your support. Uh, and really, that's that's the main message I want to drive home. But uh, something else I want to throw in there. Yeah, I'm a little bit fiery with that stuff. I mean, what else? What else can you do, right? What else can you say? It is what it is. Some people, uh, uh, whatever. In, in any case, um, what I have been doing for backers. I've got 37 backers who backed SoulTac so far, and uh, I went through I went through all my long boxes, and I basically pulled out my duplicates, my triplicates, my quadruple books. You know what I mean? All the stuff I've got multiple issues of, and uh, I've been messaging people and been, hey, do you want do you want an issue of this? And uh, I've been giving away some books, so I figured as well I'd show you some of the things. Like again, I've got uh, I got multiples of that. You know these. Uh, uh, blood feuds. Yeah. Uh, I'm not really a fan of that, but you're welcome to it. Again, these are all uh, these are all books I've got duplicates, quadruples of. And uh, again, you get an idea how much space. And these are all Hellraiser. You get an idea how much space that frees up in your long boxes. Uh, I can look at the stack already, and I think I'm only like halfway through. And this is just to make room for all the uh, the books that are coming in. You know what I'm saying? Uh, 
bunch of blood strike in there and a whole bunch of good stuff right so all those books are, are, are duplicates and extras so if you're watching this video and you're here right now uh, and you either have back soul tack and uh, I haven't been in contact with you or you're thinking about backing soul tack uh, either way DM me uh, either Facebook Twitter and uh, I'll send you a picture of what's left uh, you can tell me what you want and uh, I'll throw that in throw that in as a bonus uh, thank you as well it it does me a favor by opening up space in my long boxes but as well as it also gives you an extra an extra comic book to read just to say thank you for, for supporting my project because it is expensive uh, it's not a cheap venture um, and I do appreciate it I know I've backed uh, what does it say on my uh, Indiegogo I think it says 86 campaigns I've backed 86 other creators out there 86 other indie creators out there uh, I've supported uh, and I didn't do that for expecting anything in return really I just did that to show uh, you know what I mean hey I, I, I'm a fan of what you're doing I, I believe in what you're doing and I support you and uh, I mean that's what this is all about right uh, uh, everyone helping each other out everyone supporting each other you know what I'm saying so uh, any case yeah I know I got a little uh, irate there just like I said uh, I'm not blind I see what's going on out there but uh, anyway just keep doing what I'm doing. Uh, again, I'm doing pretty good. It's uh, 17 days in, uh, $2,000. That's that's incredible. That's amazing. Um, and yeah, maybe maybe I can get closer to that stretch goal. Again, I've already um, uh, said my intent is with this Indiegogo. This gives me the opportunity to get my book uh, anywhere in the world to anyone who wants to read it. Um, but that's not the end game of it. It's not like um, if I don't reach my target goals in this first campaign that the book is is you know what I mean that that's that's it that's that's not it at all there's always a second chance campaign uh, there's other places you can market to, uh, market your book uh, once it exists in this world um, I can then um, I go in veterans marketplaces I can sell it locally uh, at art shows and 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 stuff like that marketplaces night markets uh, you get the idea once the book physically exists in this world um, I can continue to sell it that way so uh, you know, uh, first time creator, first time uh, writer, uh, first time doing all this, uh, 17 days live now. Uh, again, it's just been, it's just been incredible up to this point. And, uh, thank you again, 37 backers. Thank you so much for your support. I'm going to keep doing what I've got to do. I'm going to try to stream more videos. I know I keep saying, um, at this point I wanted to be doing one video a week minimum. Um, yeah. It's just getting the motivation to do it, getting the energy to do it, the drive to do it, getting myself in front of the camera, uh, speaking, uh, getting that going. Uh, it really is hard sometimes, though, when there is so much negativity out there uh, to still find the motivation to overcome that and uh, say, you know what, I'm just going to work twice as hard. Um, you, can't, you can't beat me down with your nonsense. Uh, you can play your games, but, uh, uh, again, that's not going to deter me. I'm just going to keep uh, soldiering on. I'm just going to keep pushing through. I'm going to keep creating uh, the best comic book I can for you. Uh, and uh, I, I'm telling you, once you see this book, you're going to love it. And uh, I really, my, my eyes are wide open uh, to who's out there and who's supporting me. And again, thank you so much. And I will uh, find a way to return that favor. And I do appreciate that support. So I just wanted to put something together. Um, you can see I... I I am feeling the stress of, again, it's been 17 days and I haven't done a video. I know that's not right. I know I got to do more of these videos. Uh, I've updated my campaign four times, so I am doing my due diligence to keep you updated on the progress of the book. Uh, again, this is all just a learning curve, uh, but I will get better at this. I will, uh, uh, again, this will continue to grow. Soul Tax is going to keep going. Once this is done, my next goal is how to generate an audience. Uh, and how to get people interested in Soul Pack 2, right? Let's let's uh, let's get this first one done. Let's get this first one in the world. Let's show everyone what we can do. Uh, Rejig, recock, uh, and then grow from there. All right. So uh, I hope you enjoyed this. Uh, um, I hope you enjoyed this uh, this video I threw together. Uh, thank you so much for uh, being here. And uh, yeah, uh, uh, we're. 17 days out of 60 days. I still got a long ways to go. Uh, but again, this is exciting. This is fun. Uh, 
I'm really enjoying myself. Uh, this is exactly what I want to do, exactly where I need to be right now. Uh, we'll just see uh, uh, whether we can continue on this journey. Okay. So in any case, thank you so much for watching. Again, go back to my um, uh, down to my description for this video. Uh, there will be additional YouTube. Um, there will be additional YouTube shows in the description that I highly recommend uh, subscribing to. Please, uh, these are creators that have backed me. In turn, I hope you would back them. Um, uh, and just subscribe to YouTube shows. It's free. It's free to subscribe to YouTube shows, but it means everything uh, uh, to creators out there, as well as uh, there will be a few campaigns also in the description for this video. Okay. In any case, uh, thank you so much. Uh, I hope you have a great week. Take care.